so disgusting outside. It has rained in New York or been cloudy for literally, I think, 14 days straight. It's honestly so awful. It really is so awful. But if anyone has any good coffee spots, shops on Long Island, comment them, DM me, figure out a way to contact me because I want to know. It's good. I don't know why this straw is so long. I just finished getting ready. I did my hair and my makeup and just changed into a quick outfit. I'm just wearing this bodysuit from Abercrombie. These jeans that I feel like I wear like all the time. They're from Garage. They're just low-waisted cargo pants and then little like loafers from Steve Madden. But I am running late so I'm going to go get my jacket and then we are going to head to lunch. <music> got back from lunch it was great but I went shopping the other day and wanted to just do like the littlest miniest haul ever I just picked up a couple of things for my internship and just like basic stuff so the first place I went was Nordstrom and I only got one thing I wanted to look in the skim section and I saw that they had the boyfriend like long sleeve shirts and these are genuinely the most comfortable shirts ever I want to get them in every single color but I just picked up the gray one because I feel like it matches with everything and I've already worn it. It's so, so comfortable. I love it. The next thing was something I ordered actually. This was supposed to come in for when I went away, but I have another trip planned next month so I might bring this. You can't really see what this is, but it's just like a very long cover up. The back is open, kind of goes all the way down to the floor. It's like this netted material. And then I got this bathing suit top that actually I need to probably send back because it is so miniature. It's not fitting, but it's super, super cute. And I think I'm going to reorder it in a bigger size because I love the pink and the blue. Then I went to Zara and I feel like I haven't found anything from Zara in a while. I don't know why I just haven't been finding good things, but I found this skirt and I thought it was so, so cute. This could be worn so many ways, so I thought this was super cute. Then this was also from Zara. This is just like one of those body suits, but it has a bunch of like cutouts and it's meshed. It's like very, very form-fitting. It literally looks so small, but it looks super cute on with just like a black bra underneath or like a bralette. So I'm excited to wear this. And then for work, I just got a plain white shirt. Also just like perfect for lounging around the house. That was from Zara too. And then just this plain black shirt from Zara, again, like, everyday wear. Perfect for work, high neck. Um, and I can pair this with, like, jeans, any pants. So that was my little haul. Um, I think now I'm probably just going to clean my room up a little bit. Because when I got ready and filmed the reel, there was makeup literally everywhere. We are going to go to the gym right now. I've been really trying to go to the gym, like, four to five times a week. And I've been pretty consistent, so I'm definitely proud of myself for that. So it's a little bit later, I just showered and threw on some comfy clothes. My hair is still in a bun because I actually made a hair appointment. I do a blowout like twice a week, so I'm actually just going to go get my hair washed and blown out. I feel like I literally haven't sat down for like two seconds today other than eating breakfast. I'm excited to just chill and have my hair washed. That's like the best feeling ever. So I'm about to leave and go do that. I'm back. He did such a good job. My hair has not been like blown out like perfectly like this in so long. I also just got a PR package from Briogeo, so I wanted to show you guys what I got. I got a restock of the Don't Despair Repair shampoo and the conditioner, and they also sent me 
the Destined for Density Serum, which I have never tried before, so I'm super excited to try this. I'm probably just gonna chill now for a little bit. It's almost time for dinner, so I think we're gonna order dinner in tonight. I don't know what we're gonna get. So I will catch up with you guys in a little while. We are back in the bathroom. I just showered, I took my makeup off. I used the Clinique Take the Day Away Balm, and then I just used, I think it's over here actually, the La Roche Posay Cleanser. Again, I used that this morning too when I washed my face. I love this stuff so much. I feel like it's cleared my skin, honestly, like a lot. So before we do a little skincare, I wanted to show you guys what I got from Ulta. I only got a couple of things. The first thing I got is actually a restock. This is the Miel Rosemary Oil. I'll use this once or twice a week whenever I wash my hair. Before I wash it, I will put the oil in, then use one of those like scalp massaging brushes, and then put my hair up, put a little shower cap on, and let it sit for like an hour. Sometimes we'll even do it overnight and then wash it out in the morning, and I've seen such good results with that. I've used like two bottles of it already. I've been using it for like a year and a half. The next thing I got, I am so excited about it. It's actually in the fridge right now. This is the Skin Gym Cryo Chill Face Mask. It's like one of those things that you put over your face. It gets really cold. It's supposed to help with inflammation and just like feel really nice on your skin. So we're gonna use this later tonight. Then I just picked up some sheet masks. These are from I Do Care. They're the Let's Do This sheet. There's five of them in here. And honestly, I just wanted to try new sheet masks and these looked pretty, so we're gonna try these. And this is like my favorite lip gloss. It's $8 and it's from Morphe. I have one in, I think, the berry shade, but this is just a pink gloss. It's in the shade Pink Mirror and it's super pretty, I'll show you. It's super cute. I literally can never have too many glosses, so. But I'm actually gonna just put my hair up and we are going to start with a cleansing face mask first. I'm gonna use the peel off face mask. I used to use this all the time in high school and I haven't used it in so long. I love it. Um, it honestly kind of hurts a little bit when it dries, but it really, really clears out your pores. So we're gonna use this. 